A car bursts into flames after a drunk driving suspect rear ends a man sitting at a stoplight. Halim Good became trapped and was burned alive. Jermont Terry talked with the father of Four's family, and that's a, is a very emotional time for them, Jermont. Very emotional time, Devin. Now, the investigation reveals that Good was sitting at a red light here when out of nowhere that suspected drunk driver came racing down 8 Mile and she hit him from behind. Now, the impact was so forceful that it not only pushed him into the intersection, but the gas tank exploded, trapping the devoted father and husband. And now this family is asking why. Okay, man. That's gone. We ain't gonna ever get back. Raw emotions for brothers mourning the loss of their father. Just devastating to lose him, just like that. Halim Good likely never knew what hit him as he sat at a red light on 8 Mile and Ryan and Warren. The investigation shows a woman believed to be driving drunk rammed into her. You can barely make out Good's Lincoln. It caught fire, trapping the 65-year-old. He had to be going pretty fast for it to burst into flames on impact. You were in such a rush for that you had to be going that fast to kill my father. The devoted father was out that early helping his wife for 43 years. He was on his way to, take, uh, to pick up my mom from dialysis. And uh, that's around 1.32 in the morning is when she gets out of there. His wife recalls her husband's final message. Her last text message was, hey, I'm ready. And he said, okay, I'm on my way. That was, all she, that was the last thing she heard from him. Man. Now a family is left to pick up the pieces. They now realize they are part of a troubling trend of people dying in drunk crashes. Don't have our uh, father no more. And she's still, uh, she's still alive. Now police say they found a liquor bottle inside that suspected drunk driver's car. Now they say that she was coming from a bar heading to her third bar early this morning when she allegedly caused this crash. Reporting live tonight in Warren, Jermont Terry, Local 4. And Jermont, how did the driver come out of all this? She did not walk away. Um, she's in the hospital last checked yeah. in critical condition, uh, Devin. All right, Jermont Terry reporting for us live.